Well, hello there, everybody, and welcome to a game where we're going to bid on Grandma's old forgotten items and hopefully get rich off of them. Today, we're playing Storage Hustle, and as the name would suggest, we are going to be doing bids on storage auctions. Yes, it's another weird life simulator. Evidently, in my past life, I was an Olympic sprinter or something. Jesus, I don't even need a car in this game. Just let me sprint everywhere. But yeah, we're going to see how good we can do today. I have $750 to my name, and hopefully we don't lose all of that because then I I don't know what the hell we're going to do in this game. Anyways, we got to go to the storage auction site and Whiskered Warehouse. Uh, looks like the only one that's open right now. All right, so it looks like there is a bunch of lockers. I don't know much of what this means. I'm assuming the star rating is how much good stuff is in there possibly obviously the time i'm not sure what the number is maybe that's the locker number oh 41 dollars that is dirt cheap you know what i want to get some junk at the start some true junk as long as i don't have much competition why is my avatar backwards and like all bright what what what, what did you do to my logo game that is not my logo oh god there's gambling oh no oh no i think you guys know there's a problem with that uh, we have a bank. Is there loans? Yep. Yep. Okay. I can get loans as well. I am, I am gonna be screwed in this game. All right. Well, I guess we go over to the auction place and, uh, bid on our first few auctions here. Evidently, I'm also a ghost. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. This thing's a little hard to drive. All right. Here we are. Whoa. Easy now. The Whiskered Warehouse. Hopefully there's not much competition today because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Yes. The $41 locker or, well, that's the starting bid. Let's see what we got inside. What is that? Why is there a big square there? Hey, actually a lot better than I expected is a sink. I mean, there's a clock. This might be uh, good. Why is her name E-Girl? Come on. All right, so let's take our time here. <laughs> Let them do the bidding war. I don't know what I'm gonna... I, I don't know how much any of this crap is worth, so uh, I don't even know what I should go to, but I would like to win this first auction. And we're gonna throw in... Oops, she threw in as well. 76 bucks. Yeah, I feel like we can still profit. I think I'm going to stop at 100. But I won't need to because I win right here, right? God damn right I do. This is the saddest locker ever. All right. Well, here we go. That went very, very well. We got our first locker and our first win. We got a lava lamp, some open tuna cans. Great. A tea kettle, an hourglass. I truly don't know if we profit or not. I mean, there's not much great stuff in here, but I mean, it's all uphill from here, at least hopefully. Because, oh, ke the kitchen sink is a rare item. You know, they're, they're hard to find. All right, so that's good. We have a rare item, and we can just recycle that. Oh, I get experience for recycling. How nice of you, game. I appreciate that. A lava lamp. Nice. Magic 8-ball. What the hell is this? The 90s? Lava lamps and magic 8-balls, man. And old-school wind-up alarm clocks. Nice. Oh, a chandelier is a rare item as well. Almost broke it there. My bad, but that's good. Uh, that's literally just trash. Honestly, I think we at least profited here. That's pretty damn good. Is there any other ones we can do? Uh, this one starts at 65. Is there any bigger ones? Because I'd like to see 173. Kind of what's the difference here? So let's look inside. Big Mouth Billy Bass. That is intriguing me. That looks to be like maybe a music storage case or something like that. There might be an instrument in there. I don't know if I want to bid too much. <laughs> I only have $685 in this game. So I'll bid once or twice. Hillary out here looking like early Laura Croft. <laughs> what is going on? All right, you guys can have this one. I don't even want to bid that much. You guys can lose money. I wish it told me how much they were worth because I very much want to know. All right, we have this $65 one. This might be more my style. There's an anvil in there. Those are expensive. Is that a gold bar? Is that a gold bar? Oh, we are winning this. What are these names? I have to win this, dude. There's a gold bar in there. There's no way it's not worth a crap load, so... We are bidding hard just to assert our dominance. And that's right. Once I bid hard, they did not want to screw with me because they're scared of me. All right. And uh, two lockers in one day. It looks like we're going to have a collection of kettles. So that's exciting. You know what? We have a globe as well. That's a rare item. It is broken, but we can repair in this game. So hopefully I can repair that. Who takes one bowling pin? Like, where, 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 where do you even get one bowling pin? Evidently, we have an electric kettle now for my ordinary kettle collection. <laughs> and the anvil, which is another rare item. I feel like if I get two rare items in a very cheap storage locker, that should be a good thing. Uh, okay, so it's 100% real fake gold. God damn it, it got me. It's still a rare item, though, so it might be worth some money. Okay, I'm happy with that. Let's get home and uh, 
hopefully sell this stuff whoops sorry car all right well here's the collection it's actually not as much as i thought we have a repair tool and a price scanner repair tool is literally just a hammer status is bad you need to upgrade your tour tool to do this what the hell is a, tu a tour tool what is a tour tool you mean are you talking about my hammer all right so it looks like we can repair some other things we can't repair i love that repairing in this game is just hammering things as well it is price scanning time you need to upgrade your tour tool to this. This is a tour tool too? What does that even mean? All right, well, I don't know what the anvil's worth because I don't have a good enough tool, but $29 for that, not bad. I mean, that's half of my locker right there. Dude, I am profiting. I wish I could see how much all these things are worth, but okay. And all the big items, all the rare items, I can't actually tell how much they're worth. So I guess we should hold on to them until we know. $38, wait, didn't it say $38? $30 for a kettle. And $15 for this one. Why? Oh, this one's in perfect condition. That makes sense. Checks out. All right. Can we see how much the gold bar is worth? No, I need to upgrade my tool to do that. Okay. Well, I guess we can only sell crap items for right now, or I have no idea how much they're worth. How much does it cost to upgrade the tool? Repair tool 500, scanner tool 1000. Yeah, we're not getting that done anytime soon. So I guess we'll start selling the junk that we have. I think I'm going to be aggressive with my pricing. I'm going to up this to 10 uh double what it's supposed to be worth and yeah we'll see if we can actually make some decent money here oh great a monkey wants to buy my hourglass and why is that guy like that i don't like that guy already okay well we're getting some demand so that's good hmm stuff are you a legit monkey you offered me five dollars wait how, how much did you offer me where it says average value is five i have it for ten i guess he's offering ten yeah, he was. Okay, so whatever I put down is what they offer, it looks like. Oh, no. Okay, I'm doing you a favor. I'll give you 35. It was worth 30, or the average value is 30. So I will accept that. There we go. We are profiting, baby. I feel like maybe I'm not charging enough. I am getting offers right away, which is a good thing because I don't have much storage. Uh, I want to buy it. Can you mail it today? Sure. Done. Give you 17 for the bowling pin? Yeah, it's only worth 10, so of course I will. Uh, it's too cheap. I want to have it. All right. It's yours. What? No, I didn't. I didn't mean to do God damn it. All right. So yeah, everything's up. We've actually profited $6 already. So that's kind of exciting. And we have all the rare items for ridiculous offers until we can figure out how much they're actually worth. Anyways, time to go to the bed. And yes, this is my life. I just live in a garage. Uh, if you have some items you left outside your home will not be saved. Do you still want to sleep? I hope the garage is my home because that's where they all are. All right, and look at that. Spent 216, earned 222. Tooth Fairy came and I got $5. What the hell does that eat? I'm 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 an adult. What 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 is the Tooth Fairy getting? Are my adult teeth falling out? All right, well, it looks like we're on our own today, so there is some yard sales going on. Uh you can also sell homes, but I'm going to go check out some whoa. Sorry about crashing into your house, buddy. So I'm going to check out some yard sales, see how they work. I mean, it's a yard sale. I'm assuming we just buy items, but uh yeah, let's just check out that. Ah, uh, and our first yard sale. Is that a telescope? This is cool. Okay, so let's get out here. And $530 for that? What the hell is this thing? Oh, it's an epic item. It's a medieval pitcher. Okay. Can I use my price scanner on other people's things? All right. Well, if it was better, I could. Was this two guns? <laughs> I got one. Okay. The hippo. How much? It's worth $9 and they're asking freaking 30. Okay. This is why I wanted to scan because I have no idea how much this crap's worth. Okay. And that's worth 12 and 10. All right. I think we're going to bid on some items then. I can't seem to put an offer in the field. I don't know if I don't have the skill or something. So I'm just going to accept. Wait, no. 40. 40? Oh, yeah. It, it, it is 40. It was worth 52. So yeah, I'm just going to accept that. And at $12 of assumed profit. Not bad. Let's remember to take that home. Yeah, I can't write offers. I don't know if the game's broken or what, but uh, we're going to accept these just because it's getting giving me experience as well. And I should still be able to profit, assuming I don't break it by throwing it on the ground. All right, $35 for this. That is a no-brainer. And why are there so many guns? We must be in America. Um, Yeah, I'm not going to bid on anything. I don't know what it's worth. What is going on with the cars? Oh, we're like in the ground. Okay. This is a great game, by the way. Um, uh, uh, what do I do now, game? What uh, do, do I just live down here? I can actually walk around. 
fix car? How, how do I fix myself? All right, well, I reloaded and I, I was back at my house. So I just got to run back down to my car and hopefully my items are still there. Where the hell? Wait, my car's at the front? Did I just lose my items? Oh yeah, my car's just out front. Why am I parked on the road? Do I still have... I don't have any of my friggin' items. Oh, and what's weird is the garage sale's gone. So I, I doubt they're even there. I'm going to go quickly check though. All right, yeah, I believe it was... Was it here? It was one of these homes. I'm not seeing any of my items. Thankfully, I didn't buy anything expensive, so I'm not too worried about it. Kind of annoying though. All right, well, my neighbor's got some stuff for sale as well. Some very similar stuff. The only thing that's worth... I mean, that's kind of worth a little bit too, but this is actually great. This must be in perfect condition. It is, and it's worth $80 for 40 Yes, please. I shall buy this. And I can't add, put an offer in, so we're just going to accept that. All right, that keyboard already got offered $95. We shall accept that. And there is some very decent profit. Back to uh, $750-ish, but I got some good items. I'm going to go back to the auction house. Need to level up a bit to get more auction homes. So, uh, so we're going to be stuck at this one for a little bit. All right, well, the cheap ones worked well last time. Let's see if we can get some more cheap deals. Again, there's like a whole toilet in there, a suitcase. This is definitely worth at least 100 bucks. And I got it for a little over 100. Level three poor trader, baby. N that's not true, man. I, I've been doing pretty good in this game, actually. Okay, well, we got a box with... Oh, that's a, that's a telegraph. That alone has to be worth a little bit. That's a collector's item. I need to upgrade my damn uh, price checker tool. We got a toilet that's broken. Looks pretty good to me. I don't know what you're talking about. Inari cami mask. Wow, we're getting a lot of rare items. Dude, <laughs> but the cheap lockers are the way to go. A can opener. That's exciting. I uh, got an $88 one, so let's do that. And we don't got much in here besides a box and a dumbbell and some beans. So not really interested in this one, but I'll bid to like 120 Oh, don't let me win it. I actually didn't want this for 128. God damn it. I freaking won it for 128. I shouldn't have bid on it. I knew it. I mean, maybe there's something good in that box. I have no idea. I'm, I can't even sell the beans. I got a lunchbox. Yay. And a bunch of things I can recycle. I mean, the 45 pound dumbbell might be worth a bit. I also have this platform trolley, which I can sell. So that's got to be worth a little bit as well. So it's only a common item now. And the big question is, is there anything decent in this? <gasps> Ooh, there we go. We got a play box, AKA a Game Boy. That's just a bunch of hats. Oh my God, we got like a steampunk top hat. It's broken. It's okay. I can fix it with my hammer and a pipe. Great. All right. I'm happy with that one, actually. I think we might have at least broken even. All right. And unfortunately, time is too far gone now. All the other lockers are closed. So, I mean, we still got a big haul today. We'll head home, put this up for sale, see how much money we get. Okay, and after selling all my non-rare items, uh, we're at $870, almost at the point where I can upgrade my tool, and I really want that. I have been getting experience points, though, so I gotta figure out how to upgrade myself. Don't actually know how to do that. Ah, it's I. I totally expect it to be I. So we have uh, character and trader. This is a really bad menu, oh god. Amateur haggler, unlock the haggle ability. There we go. All right, so definitely want to haggle for sure. All right, we're going to mo focus mostly on haggling because I like haggling in this game. So I have bought alpha haggler. I can look good in this game and then people lose less patience against me when I haggle. So let's do that. Dude, we're going all into haggle. I think I'm going to do more experience from selling and I can't seem to unlock that for some reason. Did I not unlock this? Oh, I didn't. Um, so yeah, let's do our coming raid and then we might get more experience later on. Okay, well, we've upgraded ourselves. We got $870. I want to upgrade my tool so I can sell these rare items, but, uh, I guess we got to go out for one more day, get some junk and, uh, see how we can do. Much better day though, as you can see. Your uncle won a lottery, your share $10. My uncle's a jerk if I'm only getting $10. All right, you know what? Screw it. We're going to play some blackjack. I'm just going to, I need, I only need $100. Well, I need a little more than 100, so I'm going to bet 100. Let's see what happens here. Let's get some luck. 14 is like the worst thing to have, especially with a 9. Oh, I'm going to go over. Yep. Okay, well, that was that was well spent. Uh, let's stop gambling. I am not going to lose all my money to gambling today. I wonder if I should just throw some of these up for like 200. <gasps> oh, I got 200 for that telegraph from a monkey. Uh, 155? 180, buddy. 180. 
164. 182, buddy. 182. Dude wants to fight. <laughs> All right, I don't think we're getting anywhere with that. I don't know if I should get rid of that because it's actually in perfect condition. <gasps> Ooh, guy on the on the uh, thing as well. God damn it. 180, buddy. New offer. 173. 181, buddy. Are you kidding me? 182, buddy. No way I'm giving you that much money. Give me another offer. 183, good sir. Nope, I'm not that dumb. One million dollars, sir. Nope, that's too much. All right, we are getting nowhere here. The monkey is back. 173 now? 180. <laughs> I'm getting nowhere with this. 182. All right, dude, I'll accept it. I'll accept it. I just want to get my thousand dollars so I can upgrade my damn thing so I know how much this is all worth. All right, and I have a customer I'm assuming back on. Yes, this guy seems like a guy that buys uh, a old school Game Boy. 173. Oh, I just want to accept it, but I, ha I have to win. 180. Done. All right, I got enough money to finally upgrade my scanner tool. And hopefully at least we can see rares now. I'm going to be very sad if we can't because I should have at least $1,000 here, I'm assuming. And yes, I can scan rare items now. That makes life way easier. How much is the gold worth? 48. Is everything worth 48? No, 78 for a sink? Holy crap. Okay, fit. What? That is such a lie. Freaking dumbbells are not cheap. Okay, no one's even trying to haggle with me. I actually put these items at pretty aggressive prices. Look at this. <laughs> Literally nobody's haggling. It must be my dashing good looks now. <laughs> okay, and the kitchen sink has been accepted. The only thing we haven't sold is the other kitchen sink, but look at that. I'm at 1724 now. I've also upgraded to level five. So that means I should have a new auction to go to. Never mind. Okay, I guess I don't get to go to Thor's auction. Not sure why that's still closed. I guess we'll just head over to the other place uh, for today. Maybe we have to sleep or something to unlock the better auction. Um, but yeah, we have lots of room now. We have lots of money, so let's go bid hard. Well, I see a gladiator's helmet. I immediately have to win this locker. No questions asked. Well, by far my most expensive locker, but I won it. Hopefully, I don't regret that. Um, I guess I gotta get maybe one more level. Whoa, easy. <gasps> it is an epic item. Okay, my first epic item, meaning I have no idea how much it's worth until I upgrade my thing again. And we got two epic items in there. Well worth the purchase, I'm gonna say. And a box of nothing. Great, thanks, game. All right, but yeah, we only had a literally only a couple items in that. Four. All right, and that's it for today. We came a bit late because we sold all those items. So that's all the new things we got. Oh, I like that. That's a big box, man. That is a very big box. Okay, I gotta win this one. Well, I paid a lot for it. I think I got it here, though, for $400. And there we go. I, I'm still level 5, an unlucky hustler. I'm confused. Why can't I go to the next place? Old freezer. That's a lot less exciting than I thought. I thought it was like a storage container with something in it. Dude, this is sad. It's got poop on the side. Poop. What is poop feel? I, I, okay, it is poop feel. Now that I think about it, that is, that is very deep. All food is poop feel. <laughs> All right, well, hopefully I can drive home with this on the roof. I need, I need a better car. You can buy better cars in this game, but that's not going to happen anytime soon. We got an epic barbecue, though, and a pool queue. Okay, we have actually decent items in here. 50 shades of gray. <laughs> yeah. A singing fish. You mean Big Mouth Billy Bass? That is an epic item in this game? Nice. All right, we'll throw that. Somehow that's staying in there. Impressive. Dude, we got so many epic items in here. We got the wizard's hat as well that I wanted to get earlier. Uh, wasn't able to win that one. Got the wooden hippo I've seen at a million different yard sales. And a U.S. mailbox. That's clearly not stolen. All right, well... I think you guys know how this works now. Throw all this stuff up. Hopefully tomorrow we can go to Thor's auction because that's really what I, what I want to see. I'm sick of these low budget auctions. Okay, it's a new day and Thor is finally open. It looks like we have a... Ooh, that's a lot of money. Oh, crap. I wonder if I should just sell some of these things because I'm so excited to uh, do this. Um, I have no idea how much the epics are worth, and I need to upgrade my tool once again to get to that. That's 1500 I think I'm just going to try and sell a bunch of these real quick. I might lose some money doing this, but I don't care. I'm just here to get as much money out of this as possible. So I'm thinking like 250 per epic item should be a safe bet. And already somebody came for the Spartan helmet. I'm a little nervous about that. Um, new offer. Five... <sighs> 
can't even change it. I wonder if I can just keep canceling and like upping it until they stop bidding. Because people are bidding on 250. All right, so yeah, I'm a little nervous. We're going to up it to 400 and see what happens. I, do I don't want to waste my money. These are obviously very important items. All right, somebody came for the Spartan helmet. Okay, 400. They're accepting. You know what? I'll accept that. I don't care. I hope I didn't waste too much money. Uh, this one's accepted for 400 as well. This one, they're all accepted for 400. Maybe this isn't as, as good as I thought. All right, whatever. We're, we have so much money. I don't even care. I don't care. Let's just keep going. We'll sell everything for 400. All right. And the only thing we have left is the freezer artwork. Um, okay. Do I do my tool now? I really want to upgrade my tool, but honestly, I think we should just keep our money and go to Thor's and see what we can buy there okay this one's inside this is fancy uh these might be smaller lockers but that's okay what do we have at the start this is the one i wanted anyways so let's see what's inside got a drone some sort of weird chair a big old key oh uh, i don't know i i don't know there's not a lot of items in there all right these guys are bidding hard and fast that tells me it might be worth it I'm going to bid up to 2,000. If they go over 2,000, screw it. Oh, that's like all my money. I might regret this decision. Oh, damn it. Come on, someone bid. I don't know what I'm doing. God damn it. All right, well, here's all. Here's everything. Freaking everything that we get. An epic. A ra the drone's a rare? Key to the city? That's got to be worth something. And please, please, please have something in here. Okay, we got another drone, baby. Oh. <gasps> Why is a robot cleaner a legendary item? Oh my God. Okay. I think this was worth it. I mean, a legendary has to be worth a bit. All right. And that's probably going to be it for here. I mean, we can look around. There is some cheap auctions. Uh, starting at 1,142. Yeah, I can't really do that, can I? And the rest are not open. Yeah, there's one available at 1,400, but I'm not waiting around for three hours just to check what, what's in that. We don't have a lot of money anyway. So let's go see how we did today. A drone, this is a bad sign. It was only worth $57. Obviously, I don't know how much that's going to be worth. And I don't even know how much the epic one's going to be worth. Oh, I put the, uh, just to test the waters, I put the robot for $1,500. I got a cowboy interested in it uh, for that price. So this is really the only way I know how to kind of test the waters is uh, just put prices in and cancel them until they stop coming in, right? So yeah, until we can upgrade our price checker, um... That's the best way I'm going to do it. I'm assuming we're not getting a bid right now. So I'm assuming it's like high 1500s. Oh, we did get a bid. 1635 for it this time. Uh, I want, I want, I want 2000. Come on. 1728. I'll come down to 1900. It's too much. 1850. Come on, man. No, you cut. I keep saying that and they say it back to me. All right. I'm going to cancel that. I'm not interested. I'm going to play it patiently. We'll drop it down to 2,000 because, yeah, I definitely don't think it's worth that much. Why do I have $3,452? Oh, I think I broke the game. I think I figured out how to break the game. So, wait, what? What did I just... How did I get 5,116? I just accepted an ordinary common item. What is going on? What am I breaking? Who? Where's the customer? Okay, this guy here. 1580. So, wait, if I cancel, do I get the money? Hold on. I want to try 1800 again cancel i didn't get the money but i think if i accept a new sale it thinks it's that offer so if we get another offer here and i accept it like for example this cheap pool queue i'm just gonna drop it down to 10 bucks and if i accept this yeah dude it's broken <laughs> i have figured out how to break the game oh this is this is bad this <laughs> this is so bad all right you offered 1580 i'm gonna cancel that and sell another cheap item for dirt cheap. I don't know how much this thing's worth. So we'll sell it for a hundred because I'm going to get thousands anyways. Oh, would you look at that? He's come. Yeah, I'll accept that. And bam, $2,000 right there. This is, this is totally broken. Everyone's offering me 1580. <laughs> and if I cancel the offer, I get the full 2000 on my next offer. <gasps> oh, I have so broken this game. I love it. All right, so we'll upgrade our scanner tool now. You know what? Let's just upgrade it again, and we'll upgrade that a little bit as well. I have a new customer. Oh, no way. And it's just another guy for my broken robot cleaner that we're not going to get rid of because screw that. At least now I can scan and know truly how much these things are worth. Not as much as I thought. 
but who cares anymore because I'm rich because I broke the game. How much is this actually worth? 1,119? Why am I getting such high offers? So wait, 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 wait. Can I break this even more? Like if I, for example, put an extra zero on that, will, will anybody even come at that point? Because 2,000, they were at least coming. I don't think they will. Okay, I have a new customer. Let's just see what happens. Ready to buy it for 500. And I, I'm still, I'm still getting 2,000 for some, some weird reason. This is, this is great. Yeah, five, 502. That seems fair, buddy. Just give me the 2,000 dollars. That one didn't break that time. Why didn't that one break? 375. And I believe that was a bit more. All right. Well, in one episode, I've broken the game. Let's see how much we've earned today. Oh, I can't price check my bed. Lame. And we spent 7,800, but I earned 12,158. Ah, not bad. Not bad at all. I've definitely earned more than that, too. All right, guys. Well, I've already broken the game, so uh, go me, I guess. I didn't even mean to break it. I didn't even notice I was earning that money until it was too late. But uh, yeah. I have to say, interesting premise for the game. I really would like to know uh, if I, for example, decline uh, an, a storage bin, how much that bin is worth. That really frustrates me that you never know. But yeah, that's Storage Hustle in a nutshell, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. And yeah, as always, thanks for watching and liking. I'll see you in the next one. Hey there. Before you go, I just wanted to let you know about my second channel, Gast. If you're missing Why? my multiplayer shenanigans, then please I, consider I checking it out. Just... Scan the QR code or copy the link down below. Okay, bye. What are you? Bad. Get the frick out of here. You have to win. Hit him. Let him get the shovel or the tennis racket. Oh my god. <laughs>